park you back again because obviously I'm not going anywhere. So, I'm not in my car right now. Obviously, my truck is having some issues. Honestly, I think I'm just going to go to the one that I normally go to because I've already went to way too many new places this week and we're kind of reaching a limit. Plus, I want to drive to the one that I normally go to so that I'll have plenty of time to talk. So, hello. Long time no see. I've filmed a video since I disappeared, but I have not edited it or uploaded it. And I'm driving my car and it's really awkward because normally at least I'm like taller than them because I'm in like a truck, but I definitely am like the same level as everyone now, but at least you can actually see me. Um, I am shaking, but it's not as bad as my other one. So we get on the smooth road, it'll be fine. I think. Whatever, it's fine. I've been gone for quite a bit. I don't even remember the last time I uploaded. I don't know if I'm going to post this first or if I'm going to post like, the mask first impression that I filmed first. I probably will do this first since it's an update, but I also did talk a little bit about this kind of stuff in that video. So I'm house sitting right now, um, and that is why I'm not in my house. I mean, you probably can't tell because it's not like I show my house or anything. I've been house sitting for like four days now. I just got back from Guatemala and like the night that I got back is when I started house sitting. Once I'm done house sitting this house, I'm going to another house and like while I'm doing all this, I'm babysitting like I regularly do. I mean, it's literally been like three days since I've been back, but like I've been pretty busy. I've talked about how I have been eating clean recently and I just love it and I love cooking and like trying things. So last night, me and my friend Taylor, hopefully she'll appear on this channel at some point. I wanted to make like a clean eating pizza. It's like a two ingredient dough and it has flour and then Greek yogurt. And I was like, well, yeah, that's so good. I went to Sprouts yesterday. It was so fun. They have like a huge bulk section and I'm so excited to like get a bunch of mason jars and buy from the bulk section instead of buying food with packaging. As I was saying with the pizza dough, we made our own pizza dough. It was not good because we used coconut flour and it tasted like coconuts and it was like super like grainy and never actually like cooked all the way through. It was really gross because I literally like gagged when I ate a bite of it. Like I thought I could do it, but like coconut does not taste good when it's in pizza. And we made our own sauce and the sauce was actually really good because then after it had been like an hour of us like making that and like waiting for it to cook, we couldn't eat it. <laughs> so we just ate the toppings up and then we put the extra sauce we had on the tortilla and then the little bit of cheese and toppings we had left. That was kind of sad, but then we watched Dumplin' and ate ice cream, so that was fun because I love Dumplin'. It's such a good movie. If you haven't seen it, it's so good. It's so good. I never thought I'd be like obsessed with grocery shopping. Here I am. These past three days, I felt like more of an adult than I have just because like I'm working two jobs at the same time and I'm about to work a third. These next two weeks are going to be more consistent jobs and then also like me grocery shopping and cooking for myself and living by myself and doing this. I don't know. This feels makes me feel really independent like actually vlogging by myself. I took a shower this morning and washed my hair and shaved my legs for the first time in who knows how long. I think what I was talking about a little bit or what I will talk about a little bit in my mask first impression is that my priorities have really changed. I haven't put on makeup in like three months because I just don't feel like wasting the time on doing it and I don't know. I just don't have the passion right now. I'm sure I'm not like completely over it forever. I doubt that but like right now I'm not in the place where I want to waste two hours on playing with makeup. That's not where my time is right now. It's like in cooking. I've really been slacking on reading my Bible recently and then before Guatemala I was focusing on doing Duolingo, all the things. After I go to the bank I think I might get a K cup my cup. And I know they have like a lot of different brands that are probably like two dollars cheaper. I'd rather just get the one that's actually made for Keurig that's like guaranteed to work for Keurig. Also we don't have to buy individual filters for them. I'm really trying to like convert my family into like not using individual K cups because those aren't recyclable. Plus I just bought a bunch of coffee from Guatemala that I'm gonna need that for. And it's a lot cheaper to buy grounds. That's all I gotta say. That's what I really liked about Sprouts was because of that bulk section like you're cutting down waste. And also the lady that we had, um, she was really nice, but I forgot my reusable bags and I was like, I'm not using plastic bags. So I feel like we had too much to just carry it out in our hands, me and Taylor. Then I was like, hey, can you just put it back in like the basket, like in our mini basket? And she was like, oh yeah, no problem. And then we just brought it back up. It was no big deal. And I'm like, 
That was so awesome. Like, thank you, Sprouts. Like, I don't know. I'm just like, I never thought I'd be excited about a grocery store. I don't even know what I talked about in that mask video because that was probably like two weeks ago. I love dark chocolate now. I literally love dark chocolate and I never thought I would ever say that. I am admitting it. I love dark chocolate. I think I might actually want to film like me making this next time I make it. I have this like quinoa salad. It's so good. I'm not gonna tell you what's in it because obviously like but I found it on Pinterest. I've been on Pinterest constantly recently looking at clean eating recipes and the thing that's like more difficult about this is a lot of things is about like losing weight. I don't want to lose weight. Why do we have so many banks in one area? Oh, oh. My bar score, we made it. I'm definitely gonna turn this camera off because I don't want them to see it and that's really, really awkward even though it's literally set up perfectly. So my priorities have changed basically with clean eating, learning a language, even though I've already done two years of it, reading my Bible, not doing makeup. I really think I want to change this channel. And I never put like a label on this channel, but it was obvious that like I did makeup on this channel. And I always said like, I'm going to do what I want because people get burned out real fast and I've seen that and I don't want to be one of those people that just get burned out. And it's not even like I was burned out on makeup, it's just like your passions change. Once again, not saying that it's like completely changed, like I'm never gonna wear makeup in my life. I'm not saying that, I don't know. I just silly wanna cook more and I wanna, school's about to start and I'm, I'm about to be doing some like crafts and I wanna paint. I wanna try and paint, whether the video is like me attempting to paint or like finding something on Pinterest and trying to paint it. That's what I'm thinking, that's literally all I've been wanting to do and talk about. That's where I've been, what I've been doing. Oh, and I've also been loving country, eh? as you can see. That's something that's definitely changed. I hiked up a volcano in Guatemala and I did not poop myself, just to let you know. <laughs> I did almost pee myself, but hey, I mean, it's a change, right? Crikey, I'll see you after Target with hopefully my my cup. That definitely is not the same angle as before, but just struggled so hard with that so are we not gonna do that anymore i got my my cup and i also got a lime because i remember the you know salad i make that has lime in it let's get the show on the road shall we there were so many cute summer things in target bro though it was so hard not to get it it was so hard i was like <laughs> it was so hard <laughs> The next house I'm about sitting at is beautiful. So I'm about to be like filming all the cooking videos. All right, well I have to go. Oh no, oh no, oh no. Right, this is gonna work. That's really a good angle. Hopefully we get it along red light. Of course, like the time I want to hit a red light, it's not gonna happen. All right, crikey, not bad. Oh, yep, it's bad. <laughs> that was a fail on the way home. It was a fail because it was literally I didn't film at all because I couldn't. So. It's fine, literally, I mean, if you don't want to hit any red lights, just pretend you need to because then you won't hit any. Now you're wrapped around the steering wheel because yeah. That was my fail kind of at a drive with me. On the way there, I did talk about a lot though, so that's good. I don't know if I'm gonna make this a separate video or if I'm gonna make it the same video. I think I just wanna do like a drive with me and then like a smoothie bowl. I'm gonna try and make a smoothie bowl. I've been watching Ashley Wicca and I love her. She's a vegan and she eats smoothie bowls all the time and yeah so i'm very excited i hope it works because the other day i tried to make a smoothie with frozen cauliflower in it and it tasted really disgusting so hopefully since this is gonna be like a thicker smoothie bowl that it will taste better i'm probably gonna watch like one of hers exactly and do it exactly how she did it i think i'm gonna go in and do that right now i don't think i'm gonna stop this because i probably only have like 10 minutes of footage right now oh that's the other thing i want to talk about i'll talk about it when i'm making my smoothie bowl That's how I should drive. I should just drive like this. Would that be distracting? It's actually not that bad. It's actually really stable. Besides the fact that I would be like, vroom, 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 vroom. That's honestly kind of an idea, but it probably would like hit the horn at some point and then like honk at someone. And we might not want that to happen. Sure, crikey. It's a little crooked, but it's fine. I have a magic bullet. I'm not crazy about it. When I move out, I kind of want to get like a Vitamix like save up for it because Eamon and Beck have that and I love it. These aren't like completely frozen because I literally just put these in here this morning but at least they're colder than they would be if 
they were normal temperature, if you know what I'm saying. So this might not be the thickest smoothie bowl. I have about half of it filled with frozen bananas because that's just the best way to do it. I'm going to add a couple pieces of frozen cauliflower. I'm just going to do one big but piece. I have the berries. I have the berries. I, do not I think I put a little so much. I mean, I have everything she said except for like the vanilla pro protein powder. I always like to shake mine down. This is definitely like the thickest smoothie I've ever made, obviously, because it's a smoothie bowl. I didn't mix in chia seeds because I felt like that was something that I could probably use as like a garnish because I'm just going to mix it in anyways. She also always uses puffed rice cereal and puts it on top. She also uses like a uh, puffed corn, but like I didn't get that. They were literally right next to each other in sprouts and I was like, mm, which one do I get? I'm guessing this is just going to be like Rice Krispies without all the sugar. Oh, it literally just tastes like rice cakes. Crikey, we're going to try and make this look pretty. That's what I'm going to do on top. The puffed rice and then chia seeds, but then I'll just like mix it all together. I don't know how people eat their stuff one at a time. Is anyone else like that? I cannot just like eat my food in the bites that they're prepared in, I have to mix like everything together. And I'm not gonna like put strawberries on top either because like she always garnishes hers with the fruit that's already in it, but I'm like, that's kind of a waste. I think this is a pretty darn cute and cute little ball. Man, Ooh. here we are. I need to figure out like a cute place to take a picture. Okay, it's definitely been a full two weeks since I did this video. I literally already house sat at my other house and finished babysitting for the summer. But I'm hoping to upload this tomorrow because I finished editing this. I just have to schedule it slash upload it. And obviously like do this little part and edit this part and stay flat light. If you see this tomorrow, then you'll know that this was Wednesday night. I literally just came up here, pressed the record button, didn't do anything. I never even ended up talking about what I was like, oh, never mind, I'll just talk about that while I'm doing this movie ball. But I guess I'll just have to talk about that in another video. I'm probably about to film my outro for my other video here as well because I also didn't end that either. As you can see, a lot of my priorities have changed. I haven't worn makeup in so long. So yeah, I really hope y'all enjoyed this video. If you did, I would love it if you subscribe down below and please give this video a big thumbs up for me being back. Thank you so much for watching. Bye!